What is up guys, this is Shaveen and you're watching SoftPay. In this video, I will tell you guys how you can fix the problem that in your Android Studio Marketplace, that is the marketplace for Android Studio plugins, you go there and you find this error that marketplace plugins are not loaded and please check your internet connection and refresh. Even though your internet connection is quite good and you still encounter this problem. So before we begin with the video, I would just like to tell you guys that if you encounter any software related problems, you just comment it down on our videos and email us and we will make a solution video for you guys. Now just a quick word for our affiliate. The Keep Solid VPN Unlimited is an amazing VPN service which provides a solid DNS firewall for your PC. You can try it out for free using the link below and use the code SOFTBAY20 to get a 20% off on your purchase. Okay, so now let's begin with the video. So in order to fix this problem, it is quite simple. You just have to open up your Android Studio and then go to File and then Settings. After you get to the Android Studio Settings, you click on appearance and behavior and in appearance and behavior you will find an option for system settings in system settings just expand the system settings menu and then you will find an option for http proxy so just go to http proxy and by default it should be set to no proxy and this is what's causing the issue so in order to fix this just click on auto detect proxy settings and then make sure that you don't have any password so just click on clear passwords and then apply and save these changes after this, you just close down the Android Studio and then again restart your Android Studio. And now if you go to your Android Studio plugins, your marketplace should be working perfectly fine. If it is still not working, even though you have set auto detect to proxy settings, that means that you have to manually detect the proxy settings on the Android Studio. Now if this also didn't work for you, then I recommend one more thing and that is again going to your Android Studio's help option and then this time clicking on edit custom VM options and if you don't have a VM options folder created just create that custom VM options folder in your Android studio and then as soon as you reach your custom VMs editor make sure that you don't have the following command in your custom VMs editor and if you do just remove this command and then restart your Android studio and see if it is working now if it is still not working then just comment it down on the video and I'll try my best to solve your problem. It may be that Android Studio is not able to detect your proxy settings automatically correctly. So maybe you have to manually enter your proxy settings and as much as I remember you can find the proxies list on the Android Studio's official website and you can manually select your proxy from there. But again if you encounter any other problem just comment it down on the video and i'll try my best to solve the issue i hope you enjoyed this video and this video helped you guys consider liking and subscribing to the channel and i'll see you in the next video until then bye